outrageous, scintillating, shocking stories about music manager Roger Goodstone and his associate, 24-7, part of the Hollywood music scene for decades. <laughs> Melissa Melody extracts the truth. You managed a band called the Fist Folkers who were Christian and into the occult. Yes, the, the Fist Folkers uh, drank blood for breakfast. And they had ceremonies and had made sacrifices on stage before every show. So many hamsters. And we participated because we had to. It was in the contract. Roger had an idea for a crown of candles for the pre-show. The lights went down. The candles went up. Total spooky. And then Jim got hot wax in her eyes. It was natural beeswax, but still, I mean, it burned the hell out of her eyes. It was a thing. Uh, my suggestion was a thing from my heart. I knew them. I, I knew what they were like. I, I simply made a suggestion, and they did it. Yeah. The fist folkers didn't go on that night. No, that's, that's true. Or for the next two years. <sighs> if it was Roger Goodstone, sober, like now, um, he would not have made the suggestion. Well, you are a Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde. When I am drinking. Well, yeah, Roger Hyde is a monster, a horrible person, okay? You do not want to be around that person, okay? Roger, I mean, you have a disorder. You, you, are, you, you are a sick, sick man, okay? It's effed up. <laughs> you are a mess. <laughs> not proud of it. Well, you shouldn't be. But I don't blame you for it. 